Thank you so much everyone for an overwhelming response on our last video where we discussed the research program offered by Goa Institute of Management. Just within a day of that video's released, so many people reached out to me for a personal guidance and to know more about this program. They were eager, especially because the last date of applying into this program is the 15th of March, 2023. I had launched this channel all about PhD by Dr. Ritika Gaba in order to provide genuine, in-depth and well-researched information to all the PhD aspirant who want to gain this degree, who want to attain this degree through their sheer hard work, sincerity and passion. Over the last one year, we've discussed about UGC's regulation of 2019 and 22. We've discussed about full-time PhD, its advantages. What is a part-time PhD? How is it different from distance learning PhD? And why should working professionals pursue a PhD? And how can they pursue a PhD? We've spoken in length about the plagiarism policy related to PhD, stipends, fellowship, UGC net and its role in PhD. And of course, the most loved videos have been our videos dedicated to full-time PhD from IIMs, part-time PhD from IIMs, our, uh, our institute specific videos related to IIT Mumbai, IIT Madras, and of course, the very latest research program from Goa Institute of Management. Overall, we try to include and discuss, discuss about anything and everything which we feel would help our PhD aspirants reach their dream PhD institute. Even though we had created so many videos dedicated to various aspects of PhD, I always felt there is something still missing on this channel. I wanted to create a video where we talk about what happens after you've taken admission in your PhD program, you know, the life as a PhD scholar. Seeing such a positive response of the students towards the research program of Goa Institute of Management, I decided to reach out to the FPM office of Jim. I shared with them the responses that I had received and also the video that I had created. I requested the FPM office to let some of their current research students share their experiences about their research journey with the PhD aspirants. To my great joy, Goa Institute of Management was as excited about this idea as I had always been. They also understood and they also agreed that yes, the PhD aspirants, the future PhD student should definitely have an understanding of what they are getting into. They should definitely know what happens after the admission in the research program. So here we have some of the most brilliant minds of the FPM program of Goa Institute of Management sharing a part of their research journey with all of you. So sit back, relax, but carefully listen to whatever these students are saying and learn and understand your life ahead. Hi everybody, I am Tanaya Shah, FPM scholar at Goa Institute of Management. I am in my third year. Being a third year participant, I have learned that there are three most important things that you need to know when you are on the verge of completing your FPM. The most important is research followed by teaching and projects. And GIM has a huge pool of faculties who, will, who are expert in these domains. To name a few, Professor Avik, Professor Alan Bard, Professor Morris, Professor Shirupa. So there are many faculties around who will help you work in this. Uh, I have done two conferences, one national and one international. And I have a publication in economic research, which has an impact factor more than three. So, and all these three achievements that I have are with the faculties of GIM. So you will always get support from the faculties here. And when I started off my research journey, I had a son of six months and now he is going to be around three. So I can say you GIM will 
I am staying here in the campus with my family. So GIM will help you out in all regards. The door of GIM is open to you. The onus of studying or learning is only on you. Hello everyone. My name is Jeevan Lawrence. I am a third year FPM scholar at Goa Institute of Management. My research interest lies in uh, sustainable marketing approaches uh, wherein currently I am working on uh, demarketing and social marketing. I am happy to inform you that uh, one of my articles on demarketing got published in an A category journal with an impact factor of 7 plus very recently. I give all credit to my guide Professor Nandakumar Mekot who has been instrumental uh, in invoking interest in this particular domain and uh, has always been motivating me, guiding me throughout my research work. What makes GAM special is that uh, the research ambience here, wherein the faculty are very friendly, approachable and there is good synergy among the students. Uh, I think by now most of us, I mean my batchmates, my juniors, we know what we are working on. Uh, so we quite often we discuss our research projects, uh, we take feedbacks from them, we take suggestions from them. So uh, you know it has been very special and it has always been fun. The research was uh, not been uh, you know pressure for you. In addition to this uh, we have access to uh, most of the prominent databases, we have behavioral lab, uh, eye tracking and so on and GM has a lush green campus which is green most of the year giving the uh, you know right place to do the research work with this we come to the end of our video if you have any further questions related to the FPM program offered by Jim then you can post them in the comment section below let us know if you like this concept of PhD scholars, research scholars interacting with you through the video. If yes, then we will definitely create more videos like this for you. If you are looking for a PhD mentor, PhD advisor, somebody who can guide you through your PhD journey, then you can always get in touch with me in the number given below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe our videos. And thank you so much for watching my videos. Thank you.